Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We're taking a look at an awesome B-plus motorhome on a Mercedes chassis. This is a 2021 Integra Quest Model 24R. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about the Integra Quest and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. Again, my name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's the world's only channel giving you that true and biased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again today, I am super excited to be taking another look at the Integra Quest. Now, we've already done one of these for 2021, but there was a big price increase from the last time and we were at the factory last time so we didn't have a great review and andrea wasn't there so it's andrea's first look at it but before i begin i would like to say hi to andrea hey andrea hi everybody how's it going it's going great it's a beautiful day here in florida it's nice and warm and matt i have seen a quest before not this one the 24r i mean the 24r oh okay well anyways i am excited to see this because yes. i think that people are gonna like it yes absolutely yes. i like it they'll like it you'll like it everybody's gonna like it let's get started model is 24r but the actual tip to tip length of this motorhome is 25 feet two inches this is the Integra Quest. It is their B+. Plus. Technically, it's a Class C, but people call them B+, pluses if they're on the Mercedes chassis. Right up front, we do have the nice Integra front windshield right there with a seamless fiberglass front cap. Notice how there's no molds or seams or anything right there. Full body paint does come standard on this motorhome. And then look at these tires, Andrea. They're the Continentals. I love those. LT215-85 R16. This is made on the Mercedes chassis. It's the uh, 3.0 liter V6, 188 horsepower with the adaptive cruise control, lane assistance and everything. Right here, we do have mirrors on both sides. Nice little uh, running boards right there. Because this is an Integra motorhome, you do have the two year, three year warranty. Frameless windows throughout the motorhome and Andrea. We have an armless awning with wind sensor. Let's take a look at that. They got the fancy awning. Yeah. They got the Gerard. Well, there might not be a wind sensor. I don't know. It is a nice awning though. Wow. Great, nice power awning with the LED lights, the armless awning. And I don't know if it has the wind sensor. Nope, no wind sensor. It is A-OK. -okay. Okay. Great. Ooh, look at how these open. I like yep. that. Look at that. Uh, that one swings up. Um, you do have the uh, propane quick connect right there. Awesome. Speaker on the outside. Okay, and then this is probably going to be your propane tank. Propane tank right there. And I'll show you. We have all the specs. Bing! Right there, so everybody who's watching on TV can take a look. Look at this. Very nice how they continue the paint. Right over here, we got a little bit of storage right there. Okay. And right here's a Trumaha tankless water heater. And then right here, you have a little bit more storage with your power cord. Nice. Coming around the back, we do have a nice fiberglass rear cap. No ladder to get up on the roof. Darn. It, it is a one piece fiberglass roof. We do have a 5,000 pound hitch. Mercedes says you can only tow 4,300 pounds with a Mercedes motorhome. And right there, we do have a backup camera. Finishing up on the driver's side. 30 amp unit, so there's where your power cord goes right there. Here's gonna be your wet bay, and... Oh, okay, wow, that's a little bit harder to get to. Huh? It is, it is harder to get to, but I love the way Integra does their wet bays. And then right there's where you dump your black and gray tank right there. I think the piston should have all went all the way up on that one. Well, the slide out, yeah, that's the problem. that's true. Uh, right over here, we do have a little bit more storage. 
Okay. And then here is gonna be your generator. And it is a Cummins Onan LP3600 generator. Well, Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. Cargo carrying capacity. Mm. Whoa. Whoa? Not good. Not good? 766. Okay, well, it is it's, a Mercedes. It's what you want. Look at this, guys. I like that bunker with the cab with the window. Very nice. I like the colors in here. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, so I'm walking through. As you can see, it is a little tight, but doable. And the bathroom is back here. Yes, ma'am. Now, Andrea, while the slide out's coming out, we have a huge favor to ask everyone. If you could, please leave down in the comments below. Let us know three things you like about this motorhome and three things you don't like about it. The more people to comment and smash that thumbs up button, the more people YouTube likes to promote our videos to. And we thank you guys. And we thank you guys. And then Andrea, I do want to give a special shout out to our brand new sponsor, My Waggle. Bing! In a few days, we are going to have um, a video. They're, they're sending me the product to do a full review on. But what My Waggle is, it's an application that you would put right here in your RV near the thermostat, okay? and it stays out of the way and it syncs up to your cell phone. So this motorhome does not have auto gen start. So what the My Waggle does, it set, gives you notifications on your phone. And if the power goes off or the AC unit goes off, or if it gets too hot in the RV, or if your dog's in distress or something, it will send a notification to your phone. Wow. We have a link down in the description below for 50% off on My Waggle, promo code, Matt's RV reviews burr, burr, burr. and um it's just an amazing product that I found and for $99 it is 100% worth it oh I, definitely I, I know I know Andrea would buy that for you <laughs> um and we're not gonna have to buy one because they're gonna send us for one for us to put in our motor home but it's just a great product mywaggle.com link down below and uh you'll see a video in a few days coming out from it ah uh, that is so exciting Yes. No more worrying about, you know, when you leave your animals behind. Yep, exactly, exactly. Okay, Andre, let's start up here in the Mercedes cockpit area. This is so nice. So, big thing. You want to make sure it has the 10-inch screen. Uh, that was a change that they made from 2020 to 2021. This so you know how it has the adaptive cruise control and everything. You got your camera system right here. This is going to have Apple CarPlay, navigation, Android Auto, and every, adaptive cruise. Everything you want is going to be right here. You're going to have your memory seats right there. You just push a button and it sets to it. Power windows and everything. Andrea, would you like to sit in my co-captain seat? Sure. Oh. Oh, you bumped your head. Okay, very nice. Yes, ma'am. How do you oh. feel? Plenty of space? Yes. And you know, I love it up here. I feel, I don't know, I, I don't feel intimidated, you know? And I feel like I have a lot more leg space yeah. than I normally would. For sure, for sure. Yeah, I love it. It's, and It's pretty comfortable. And both seats do swivel yes. to part of the living area. And, and like you said, with the memory seat, yep. you can uh, memorize that, I guess. <laughs> memorize yeah. it. Yeah. I, I guess that, you, that is what it's called. Yeah, when you... however you want it to be. And then you got a pedestal table that would go here. Yep. So that's great that you get extra seating. Perfect. And then above the cab is the bunk over the cab, okay? So here's your cushions for when the seats do swivel. This is a filler right here. And it fills in just like this. Nice and easy. Oh, uh, no. Uh, uh. Oh, no. Man. Womp womp. And as you can see, there's a ladder right there, you guys. And so that would go there. Yes. And the bunk over the cab, Andre, even though, even though this is the Mercedes, it still holds 750 pounds. What? Yep. Are you serious? Yep. That's crazy. Wow. Uh, the nice big windshield up there, USB power and everything. That is awesome. Over here. Well, I guess that would be your cargo can capacity. Right. Exactly. Again, if you want the Mercedes, that's what you got to do. 
Over here in the living room area, above the dinette, look at the cabinet. The Euro look. I love the Euro look. Nice, shiny, very good. Clean. Clean look. How do you like the balances? The balances are, are cute. Okay. We have daytime shades and privacy shades. Nice. I love how it has both. This dinette does have cup holders, okay? And it does drop down to make a bed. Now, what I like about this is I like the table. Um, yeah, it does drop down to make a bed. Yeah, it's one of those. Okay, cool, yeah, very nice. And then over here, uh, kind of in the kitchen's where your TV is. It's gonna be kind of centrally located between the dinette and the sofa. We'll show you that in a second. And then here is your sofa. Now this sofa does Murphy down into a bed, which we'll show you in a few. And then there's even storage drawers awesome. underneath the sofa. And before we drop the sofa down, Andrea, it's now time for the MSRP. MSRP on this motorhome here is... One sixty eight seven fourteen MSRP sale price as you can see here we currently have it twenty three percent off pretty good to one twenty nine nine ninety five that is a fantastic sale price for anything in this market on a Mercedes but Andrea yes even though this is the hottest RV market in history and even though this is one of the hottest RVs in history. We can always do a little bit better than that. Andrea, tell everybody what to do. You can call, you can text, you can email, you can FaceTime. Hey, 301-906-0962 or mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or the best thing to do is go to mattsrvreviews.com. There you'll see a contact tab with three choices. If you're ready to buy this RV or any RV, click tab number one. That takes you to General RV, and somebody from my team will get you the best price in America. If you have questions about this motorhome, click tab number two. That sends an email to both Will and myself, and we answer you within 24 hours. Or if you just have a generalized fan question for me, or really Andrea, click that third tab, and Andrea monitors that email. And Andrea, it doesn't matter if somebody clicks tab three, two, or one, there is one thing that every tab has in common. They'll get the best price in America. <laughs> Andrea, let's continue the video. Okay, Matt. Well, I want to point I'm sorry. Out. Huh? Oh, were you about to point out what I was about to point out? No. What? The Bigfoot auto leveling. Oh, no, I didn't even see it. I didn't even look for it because you don't see that on Mercedes motorhomes wow. ever. Oh, I know. Usually they don't have leveling on class B pluses. Right. That is insane. Wow. That's so cool. Oh, you guys, that is a big deal. Okay. What were you about to I say? I was pointing out the lights up here. Nice. So yeah, I'm a big fan of extra lighting. So we have a nice cabinet here. Look, look how at big that. it is. Very big. I like how it's curved. Uh -huh. Love the hero look. I love that you get this big window right here. Look at that. Very nice. You got the, well, I guess you got blinds here. Yes, just right there. Yeah, okay. But, I mean, it makes it so much more brighter in here. Yes. You got a round sink, you guys. Good for a crock pot. Extension, and you have a cutting board right here. You know, you know, we're hating on the round sink, but Andrea, look at the amount of, of countertop space. Yeah. That's all. Awesome. I mean, you don't see this. that in some 30 foot motorhomes. That is a great space for a garbage can. Man, it's big. I love this solid surface countertop. Um, very, very pretty. No, it's not. It's, it's not. No, <gasps> it, it's something else, though. Oh, it's not. It's not a laminate, though. No. I forget what it was. It's something else, but you know what? It's the mysterious. Uh, the, 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 What's it called? Mysterious. It's mysterious. It's mysterious. Oh, okay. I don't know what it is. Guys, I, I'm telling it's nice. you, it it's looks light. like it and, it, and it feels like it when you touch it, but it's just not heavy. And here we got the TV, which I always have a hard time. Oh. oh. So we do have a little bit uh, on this side over here. Your Sony player you was on see. that side. Yeah. I do like you can swivel this whatever way you want to. Yep, exactly, exactly. So that's nice. Okay, and we got, look. Big wow. drawers. Huge drawers, wow. Andrea. Wow. We got six of them. Very nice. Very, very nice. And then we have a convection microwave. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Two burner propane cooktop, you guys, with the mm -hmm. glass cover. Check out the sides flash here. Very nice with the LED lights. Yes. Very cute. 
And we got another cabinet up here. Okay. There's your panel. Got some mm -hmm. storage back here. And look at this refrigerator. Nice little fridge. You know what? I'm glad they gave you this side because most of the time, is there a lock on here? There we go. No. Most of the time, it's sometimes just the small ones, yep. you know? But look at this. They're actually giving you a freezer too. A little freezer. Maybe you could put uh, like a hot pocket in there oh, or something. Oh, look at these. These are so cute. Yep. You can put like an apple in there. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. No, I'm talking about how they used to make them where you only had this much. Right. True. This has come a long way. That's the truth. There's your pedestal table for up front. Yep. I guess this would be your wardrobe slash pantry. Yes. Mm, very very nice. nice. And now for the bed. All you do is turn that and you push uh, the button. Uh, 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 oh. It's the cushions. There Sorry. we go. Sorry, I'm He there. always forgets that. I always do. Okie dokie. What would you do without me? I'd probably fail miserably. No. Look at this. It's so mm. cool. Look. So it doesn't have legs no okay no very quiet very nice easy to use um good size bed andrea Man, oh comfortable it too. is comfortable it's definitely not not comfortable right over here we got some storage and then notice this i love how the storage won't open it's unless locked. you do the roller thing yeah. right there okay really nice you have the window right there um kind of, just nice just a nice little unit you got power and usb on both sides there yes um uh, Got it's a just, little bit of a ledge there. Yeah, not, not much. much. Good for a cell phone. But I gotta say, most Murphy beds are not comfortable. This is pretty comfortable. Yeah. I don't I know like what they're using. Yeah, just I like, like memory it's foam, not the type but that it's comfortable. Folds in half either. And it did come with the cute little pillows that goes with the bed, you guys. Yeah. Full show. Very cute. And then when it's up, it's like you eat. It's like you wouldn't even know. And then it was you there. just put the the cushions right back on. Yes, ma'am. Now how that that is talking about saving time, isn't it? Yeah. Full show. You get those beddies for the bed. You just zip up. Just zip them up. Yep. And then finishing up. Decent sized shower on pocket door on the bathroom like that. Okay. Check oh. this out. Oh. Nice Nautilus style door. I okay. like that. I'm getting the good height right here, checking it out. All right. Look at this. Nice medicine cabinet. Nice medicine cabinet right here. Mm-hmm. We've got another cabinet here. Oh, look. Look how big that is. Wow. You could definitely use that for your wardrobe. That's insane. And linens. And under here, we have more cabinetry. Uh-huh. Cute little sink. Yep. Nice little window to air it out. What's this for? The aqua That's, heater? Or yep. the, for the hot heater. Okay. Yep. And, and then, then Matt's going to try the toilet. I don't know. Porcelain. Oh my God. Um, I think I said this last time and I'm going to say it this time. It, it's passable, but I just feel a little claustrophobic in here. So I'm not going to give it a prime pooping position, but I love how they gave it a porcelain toilet. Very nice. Oh, and then here. Andre I'm has like a little door. You in there. Lock the stink in. How is it? <laughs> it's. What's the matter? You don't want me to close the door? No. <laughs> okay. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. Now, before you leave, it's now time we give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Three things we dislike about it. Okay. I got mine. What's yours? Mine's outside. Well, I'm going to start inside then. You ready? I don't like this flooring material. I, I don't know what it is. Yeah. I'm just not a fan of it. It, it is kind of weird because it's like an outdoor type of carpet. Right. But you almost feel like you don't want to see any carpet in here. Right. Yeah. So it's better than carpet. But I'm just not a fan of it. Right. That is one. Andrea, two. Oh, I don't like the wet bag. No, you can't yeah, say I, that. I don't. I don't like it. I, I, and now I can't even get to it. I like the wet bay. So I'm going to veto that. And I, I we're, we're going to say the swing up doors. What, do, what, I, what I don't like is... The accessibility to it. Yes, exactly. It's so... The wet it's, bay is fine. It's hard to get it's to. It's the accessibility. So this is what I'd have to go through every time if we were camped and I needed it to, uh, yeah. you know, flush and Correct. all these things. And no, it just, it's not fun. I 100% agree with you. And if you notice right here, 
Uh, I would say almost all the doors. I don't like that they swing up at all. Well, actually, that doesn't bother me because if they didn't swing up at all, they would be the other way. They'd swing sideways. And we wouldn't like that either. I, no, we like to swing sideways. I promise you we do. We prefer it swinging sideways. But than I will say up. because they do swing up that they open up more than some that I've seen. Pros and, hey, pros and cons. That's why I love it. So that's two. And then number three is going to be the awning. Um, the fact that it doesn't have a wind sensor and it's the armless awning, that's just kind of silly to me. We were really expecting that for the Gerard. Right, right. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Great. So that's three things we don't like about it. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. You okay. ready for me to go first? Sure. I love the Murphy bed. I love how easy it is to drop it down. Uh, it was a push of a button. It wasn't. didn't have any extra steps. The bed was actually very, very comfortable. So that's one. Two. Two, I love this kitchen layout. Yes. I love all the counter space. All the drawers. And the drawers. And the countertop. Great storage space for how little this is. Yeah, the amount of storage yes. is insane. And then can I do my third? Really, you yes. wanna do number two and three? Yes. You think we should, folks? Yes. Okay, go ahead. This. Okay, we know why it's 750 pounds, because yep. it's an Integra. Yep. Integra, that is their max on all their bunks. And that front windshield yes. is absolutely fantastic. Definitely. And yep. that shade does go down as well. Yep. So I am very happy about that. It's not where you can't fit anybody up here. Mm-hmm. It's just great. It's exciting. I love it. Me too. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. That's the Integra Quest. Let's step outside. It's been such a beautiful day here in Central Florida. If you guys have any questions about this RV, please call me, text me, send me an email. It is mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or 301-906-0962. That is my personal cell number or the best thing to do is to go to mattsrvreviews.com and click one of the three contact me tabs. In a few minutes, you're gonna see, uh, if you're in the market for a Mercedes Class B plus Class C, you're gonna see what competition it deals with right there and there. Also, make sure you guys tune in next week to see our brand new spot sponsor my waggle um with their product review it's a really exciting product it's inexpensive and it's great for your uh little pets if you bring them camping for with your you little fur babies andre do you have anything you want to say yes hey everybody thank you so much for watching let us know the three things that you like about this rv and the three things that you dislike integra does read all the comments you guys so make sure you go ahead and comment that way if we want to change anything it'll actually get done Yep. I hope you guys are all safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you, absolutely, everybody, so much for watching. Andrea, we'll, we'll see you, you next time. time.